check if the throttle is working, we need a battery source. We need 3 to 5 volts. Here I connected two 1.5 volt batteries, which gives us 3 volts, which is enough for us to test the throttle. This throttle has two connectors, one with three wires and one with two wires. We need the one with three wires. It has usually red, black and green. Red is positive, black is negative and green is signal or communication wire. Now let's do the connection. Connect the positive of the battery to the red wire, which is positive of the throttle. Now if you see, the wire can't go in. So you can use a paper clip, flatten it out, push them into the three pin connector of the controller. Now connect the positive to the red wire of the throttle, negative to black wire of the throttle and to negative terminal, connect the negative of the multimeter. To the green wire, connect the positive of the multimeter. When I twist the throttle, the voltage varies. It goes from 0.8 volts to 2.3 volts, which means the hull sensor in the throttle is working. Now let me show you how a bad throttle will perform. We did all the same connections which we did earlier in this video. Now, when we twist the throttle, there is nothing happening. The voltage doesn't change at all. This means the throttle is bad. So this is how you can check your throttle using a multimeter. In the future videos, we'll replace the hall sensor inside. It is a very easy process. So for that, keep subscribing to the channel and I'll see you all in the next one.